Hi, I'm Steve Jones and I'm going to explain how to do long division. First of all, long division is usually dividing by numbers greater than 12 because any number up to 12 you can divide in the normal way. But a number bigger than 12 we have difficulties with and I've selected 13 to make it simple to actually do on the board and explain. My normal way of doing it will be to put the number that we're going to be dividing there, 230, and we're going to divide it by 13. So I would put the 13 here on this side. All right. Now, when I start this process, my decimal point is here, remember. First of all, I'll say, try and divide 13 into 2. Well, obviously, 13 doesn't go into 2, so that's simple enough. It won't. But 13 will go into 23, and it means that I'm already at this point, and my first figure will go here. 13's, I can only get one 13 in 23, right? Which gives me 13, okay? So I'll put the 13 here. That's the 13, okay? Now, I now have to subtract the 13 from the 23. I will get one, zero, and now I bring down the next number. Now I say 13's into 100. Well, 13's into 100, well, there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 13's will give me 91. And I'll put the 91 there. Normally what I'd do is say 7 3's are 21, 7 1's are 7, 8, 9, 91. Right? Now here's the decimal point. Okay, so my answer at the moment is 17 here. Right? But now 100 minus 91, we know, will give me 9. I get 9 here. So here we have the 12 remaining. We bring down the next 0. 13's into 120 will be 117, which is actually 9. And we'll get our 117 here. And of course, we get 3 left, and so on. And I can keep going on, but I don't have to go any further to show you that we've got a 17.69 is the answer. The problem with long division is you can keep doing it as long as you like. You will get a very, very long number here. But there is no point going to more than four significant figures, two places of decimals in this case. So this is simply how to do long division.